All right, this is Valads, and I'm just going to talk about arrays. And arrays are very useful in scripting in Maya. I'm using Mail right now, so the syntax is uh, the variable, the the variable type, then followed by the variable name with the brackets, followed by the equal sign. Then you declare what your array is. So these are the values for my array. And the syntax within the list of the arrays is uh, double quotes, double quotes and uh, comma. Now you put the name of the index, the array index inside the quotes and the comma tells the array that it's looking for the other array in the sequence. So I have three values for the index. So I have torso control, hip control, and head control. Now each one in sequence is followed by a comma. So when the index finds, uh, this is index zero, it starts with zero. So Index zero would be torso one. Index one would be hip control. And index two would be head control. Now it it's, has the comma saying that, okay, I'm looking for the next index in the series. So the next index would be zero one, uh, index one. Then this one has a comma saying it also is looking for the other index. And that this is index number two. Now after number two, there is after number two we want we don't want to find any more indexes, so we have no comma. We leave out the comma. If if there was to have a comma and we print let's see value one, it will give a, an error, a syntax error, because the code is looking for a value that isn't there. So let's just remove this. And if we run it, it will print hip control one. Uh, because in this print statement, we said we want uh, val arts, uh, set array to find the number one index. And number one is hip control. If I did place number two, it will give me head control. So if I print this out, head control. So the indexes are important. And just to know that all arrays in Maya, it starts with zero. So even if we have one, two, three, in, uh, three values, it starts at zero, one, two. So even if we have three, it's always one less. Zero, one, two. All right, so this is it. Um, this was just to show you an error. And I, I made a comment. Uh, this script below won't print correctly due to the comma at the end of the last index value. Arrays with a comma at the end is awaiting for the missing value which wasn't defined. So also make sure when you declare the last array value there is no comma. And just like in mail all commands end with the this um this operator. This um yeah. And that's about it. So just keep that in mind. I'm out.